Aquarius. Hello Aquarius and welcome to your divine union empowerment video for June 2015 and this is for all aspects of your life different kind of themes can come up for this so anything can really come up but mainly what it's all about is empowerment how you can take everything forward in the most empowering way You've got brilliant new ideas and inspirations and in seeing the truth of a situation, a challenging beginning. So it sounds and it feels like there's something really new beginning. So there's lots of maybe kind of um, ideas or thoughts of how is this going to go forward? How is this going to pan out? Um, but the new ideas are all really good. They are all really um, inspired. So you have to just take action now based on those. You're looking kind of back to the past. And so there might be some sort of challenges there as to how to go forward. Um, the card that's coming up is the Six of Water. And it's talking about memories from your history or childhood. Issues regarding children are romanticizing the past. So... So a lot of the new ideas that are coming forward might be met with um, some challenges regarding like how is that going to work out but what about the way that things have been in the past and so it's really just all about a, sort of really assimilating all of your new knowledge, all of your new ideas and bringing them together and forward in a way where you know you can really kind of um, meet your past and, and move forward from there. It's really coming from a life event, which is a kind of major life event here. This is 16 and it's life experiences. So it's really a powerful revelation that leads to change. And that's really what is at the, the forefront and the heart of everything. That's what's really bringing about the change and all these different new ideas. And um, it's really coming from a time where there's been, this is two of water, and it's really talking about a time where there's been a lot of forgiveness, resolutions of um, conflict and relationships that really continue to grow closer. So it's really a maturity level that you've reached, Aquarius. And it's showing that because of all of this, there's some sort of celebration taking place. It's a day of water. And so it's kind of like the three of cups, a celebration, a wedding graduation, a birth announcement, or they need to have more fun. So that's an amazing card that you've got then for June 2015. That's brilliant. That's a really happy, exciting card. That's like the celebration card. Um, the Three of Cups really, but on these cards it's um, the Three of Water. And really what's going to come from this is in the near future, you've got happy outcome, brilliant new ideas again, talking about all the ideas here that are really leading to success and really having confidence in yourself. So you're going to have a lot of confidence from all of these new ideas that you've been kind of like, um, you know, have been spring to mind and that you've been utilizing and um, they've really been working out really well. And your strength, you seem to be able to have a really good auspicious time with gifts of money, time or effort, new career opportunities opportunities receiving a loan or paying off debts so it's kind of like everything's really coming together in June 2015 that's really good um, and outside of yourself the influence outside of yourself is a structural one it's an organization and this really kind of um, can speak about uh, you know um, it could be a person with these types of qualities and it also can kind of link to different kind of organizations as well either way there's organization and logic and structure and discipline there's some sort of um, type of leadership so it may be that someone's exalting you in your path in terms of leadership um, or that they're very good with that and bringing those kind of qualities to the fore and then for your hopes and fears it's really about um, being yourself and continuing to let your new ideas flow through because 
and maybe in the past you have kind of looked towards what everyone else would do um, but now you really have to be yourself so you've maybe got some hopes and fears surrounding that and how to take things forward but you've been doing really well so I don't really see that as much of a challenge. And it says look at things from a different perspective a temporary standstill so maybe there's a standstill with something and that could be something that you have hopes and fears surrounding. Um, ultimately though you've got the King of Fire which is the main outcome for June 2015 and it's saying focus 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 communicate with vision and be a leader advice from someone creative so I really do feel like um, the one that was coming up here uh, about this kind of like leadership here we've got the Emperor Archangel Michael being the fact that this is your outcome and it's for you I really think that um, it certainly is maybe someone that's exalting your path in terms of leadership and how to be a leader. Um, so maybe it just means that from the outside you're having to take a leadership role. So that's really good or kind of like leadership is being kind of placed um, upon you. So that's very, very um, auspicious and I think that that's the main one there that you have to focus on which is the sun. And again, that's Archangel Uriel. Happy outcome, brilliant new ideas that lead to success. Have confidence in yourself. That's the main message for June 2015, Aquarius. Hope you have a wonderful June 2015. And we are also going to be having a um, spa retreat on the island of Arran. Um, from July the 31st to about the 3rd of August and if you'd like to come along to that you can find out more details on the link below this video as you can book your spa retreat on the wonderful magical island of Arran in Scotland for this July to August 2015. Speak to you soon!